Good morning and welcome. Thank you for joining us in today's program. We are very much excited to launch the first ever series of pre-week reviewer material for the eight subjects of the bar, the pre-week reviewer for jittery bar takers. This is, of course, by our beloved and honorable experts in the eight fields of the law. But before anything else, let us open the program with a prayer. We would like to enjoin everyone to be in the presence of our dear Almighty Father for our opening prayer, to be followed shortly by, by the singing of our national anthem. In respectful presence of our brothers and sisters across boundaries and faiths, let us all join in prayer and worship and gratitude and for guidance. Almighty and eternal God, we thank you for the gift of life and all its joys. We thank you for today, for all its challenges in all its splendor. We thank you for the gift of one another. O God of infinite mercy and wisdom, only in unity with your will can all our toils have true meaning. Transform us into willing and able stewards of this world and its future. Bring us together to work with understanding and compassion as we toil and grow weary we pray for renewed strength and resolve. As we experience pain and sorrow, let us be reminded of untold good beyond. As we see pain and suffering, let us be instruments of your peace and extensions of your loving and healing hands. As we gather here today, bless us all that our collective knowledge be tempered and guided by your wisdom. Grant us clarity of vision to see the common good amidst all distractions. Endow us with humility and purity of heart to transcend all differences and reservations. When we leave this gathering, let us be the change we seek. As we endeavor to practice what we learn, let us be the good we want to see in others. As we work for our learners and their future, let it be that your will be done. In solemn silence, let us conclude with our own personal prayer. Before we get to the exciting parts of the program, we would like to inform you that we have arranged an online raffle. Yes, our dear viewers, you have a chance to win a copy of these books, the complete volume of the pre-week reviewer for Jittery Bar Takers. Now, all you have to do 
is register now in the link pinned in the comments for you to be included in our live raffle draw later. Now, if you're the lucky winner, all you have to do is to, have to comment present in the comment section within 30 seconds after I announced your name, all right? Comment present, don't forget that. Okay, so please make sure that the raffle winners, okay, that you note this, okay? The raffle winners have to note this. Um, if you weren't able to comment present within the allotted time, you will be disqualified, okay? And the team will draw another winner should that happen. Now, the announcement of the five raffle winners will be done later before the end of the program. So make sure that you stay with us all throughout the event. Okay, so good morning once again, our dear partners in learning. 2021 is such a big year for Rex, and we are very happy to be able to share this milestone with you as we continue to serve you as the new, bigger, and better Rex education. From the mid-20th century, during a time of challenges and hopeful rebuilding, from an alliance of shared passion, Rex was born, persevering through decades, sustained by faith, emboldened by vision. Rex has become a tradition of service to the nation. With its first publications, Rex pledged itself to a more proactive role in education. As evolving education required new tools and services, so did Rex expand. In the dawn of the 21st century, when education is demanded to foster learning in all forms, learning within and beyond the walls of institutions, for sustaining today for the future. We are championing education. We are now Rex Education. Now to officially open today's event, let us hear from the Chief Executive Officer of Rex Group of Companies, Mr. Don Timothy Buhay. Morning, everyone. To our esteemed lined up of authors, guests, and professors who have been most gracious to share their time with us today, to our dearest students, bar reviewees, of course, Honorable Chief Justice Alexandre Gismundo, partners in education, ladies and gentlemen, again, good morning. Let me start this very enlightening and empowering day ahead of us by warmly welcoming everyone to the official book launch of our newest offering for the bar reviewees, entitled The Pre-Week Reviewers for Jittery Bar Taker Series. Another fruitful partnership between Rex Education and our group of outstanding authors. It's amazing how we have conquered the years 2020 and 2021 again. Here we all are gathered in spirit and in mind to help low hopefuls across the country as they take our one of the most important tests in their lives. Last year, we were caught by surprise as an inescapable threat to global health and safety caused irreparable damage to the lives, jobs, and dreams of millions of people around the world. But true to our tradition of service and guided by our Educampion philosophy, Rex remained relentless in our duty to champion education. When the country and our students needed it most, 
we delivered on our commitment to assist and empower duty bearers in the field of education to rise above the occasion. As we continue to traverse what they say now is the new normal, quality education at any cost must not be sacrificed. And with the tremendous help of our partners, legal luminaries, we are confident that we can help our law learners continue learning and continue dreaming. We cannot express fully how grateful we are for this opportunity to serve the Filipino who learner better through this law book, authored by the country's most dedicated lawyers and educators with the initiative to give back to the profession that has given them so much. The honor is truly, truly ours. To the students here with us today, I hope you are all excited as I am to spend the next two hours with our esteemed authors as they share with you how this newest offering for the legal community can help you go through all the essential concepts within the limited time that you have days before each exam. To our dearest authors, allow me to congratulate you for another feather in your cap and to express our deepest gratitude on behalf of Rex Education for being our partner in championing legal education. To everyone here with us today, that you are all a beacon of inspiration and hope. That despite everything that is happening around us, the fact that we are all trying our best to push forward, to continue chasing after our dream is a symbol of human resilience and strength. Like all of you, I am very much looking forward to a very insightful and inspiring session today. So again, thank you. Thank you, everyone. Good morning and God bless to all. All right, thank you very much to our Chief Executive Officer of Rex Education, Mr. Don Timothy Buhain for that very warm opening remarks. Now, to render the message from the publisher, may we call on the chairman and president of Rex Education, Attorney Dominador Buhay. Okay. Thank you to our CEO for the warm words of welcome. And to everyone here today, ladies and gentlemen, a blessed and illuminating morning. It is my honor to be present here today on behalf of Rex Education, a brand, a community, an advocacy, and a tradition of service dedicated to inspiring every Filipino lifelong learner to advance themselves and uplift others. A lot of people may not know this, but Rex Bustor began in 1950 as a, uh, as a bookstore in Muscarga, which is now called Recto. Engaged in the buying and selling of secondhand books, and now, 70 years later, we have thankfully evolved from that iconic bookstore to something comparatively bigger and more, more significant. From just beginning, providing learners with published educational materials 
we are now accompanying everyone throughout their life long journey. Learning in all forms beyond the walls of institutions, learning for delight, enlightenment, and fulfillment. While we are also committed fully to the mission to champion legal education, the task is too great for us to do it alone. That is why we are fortunate that we are empowered in this journey by our fellow Ido campions, teachers, students, stakeholders, educators, every Filipino, and of course, our dear and our dearest and esteemed authors. As we work together to make Philippine education better and accessible to everyone. So to our beloved partners in education, our authors, thank you for the trust given to Rex for putting into completion the pre-week reviewer for G3 Bar Takers series. May I be privileged also to acknowledge today the presence of the Honorable Chief Justice Alexander Esmundo, who has been very kind to take a moment from his very, very busy schedule to grace this event. Allow me to take these excerpts from his speech before the members of the Justice and court reporters association, justice, re justice reporters organization, officials, and employees of the judiciary on June 11, 2021. The theme for the 120th anniversary of the Supreme Court is Open Court, Court Suprema, Naglilingkod ng May Kakayahan, Integridad, Katapatan at kalayaan. Although the words competence, integrity, probity, and independence are used in our Constitution to describe the particular traits of members of the judiciary, of the judiciary, judiciary rather, I believe that those who are those are the traits we should apply equally to all the components of the judiciary as a whole, be it justices, judges, court officials, and court personnel. His statement was quite straightforward. As members of the legal community and as future lawyers, we also share in this responsibility to uphold integrity and competence in everything that we do. Under a similar vein as soldiers of justice, I hope that we all maintain and aim for this outstanding level of professionalism and morality in everything that we do. To our bar hopefuls, let this be a reminder that we are here to help guide you to the path of integrity. We hope that the pre-week reviewer for G3 Bar Taker series is just not another reviewer to get you to where you want to be, but an instrument that will help shape you as the country's future leaders and lawyers. With that, thank you so much. Congratulations to our partners and good morning once again to one and all. Okay, thank you very much, Attorney uh, Dominador Buhay. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we are very honored to be joined by a legal luminary who will be sharing his inspirational message to the 2021 Bar Hopefuls and also to all the students and professors who are tuning in on this event. Everyone, with much respect, let us give a warm virtual welcome to the Chief Justice of the Supreme Court of the Philippines, Chief Justice Alexander Gesmundo.
with not even close to half of those who take it pass, the bar examinations has been touted to be the most difficult of all government licensure exams. Perhaps rightly so, because of four, four straight Sundays on eight different subjects is burdensome, not only to the mind and body, but especially on one's spirit. It is no great secret that the key to passing the bar is finding one's style of studying and learning. Just as many would choose to study alone or at home, others find comfort in attending review classes, trying to figure out whatever else they have missed or in challenging oneself after knowing how much others have gone ahead in their readings. But after all, the bar materials have been read, one is still left on his own to hear the last four Sundays that would determine the examinee's future. While there is no shortage of books to prepare a bar examinee during these last weeks of the bar, the pre-week reviewer for jittery bar takers is a welcome addition to the list and expectedly one of great help to its users. I am confident in the authorship of the series as they are composed of well-seasoned academicians respected members of the bench and the bar, long-time practitioners and professors of law. May their words echo in the minds of bar takers and law students alike and guide them to achieve their dreams. It is a happy coincidence that one of the authors, Judge Rigor R. Pascual, worked for me as court attorney in the Supreme Court before becoming a judge at large of the regional trial court. He undoubtedly brings to his book Years of experience in research and analysis gained from drafting decisions and resolutions in complex cases, not to mention his experience in the academe. A writer once said that we write to taste life twice, in the moment and in retrospect. Through this series, the authors have reprised their bar experience by sharing with the readers, in effect, how they were able to make it during the crucial weeks of the bar exams. Doubtless, the collective experiences of the authors fused into a four-volume work makes studying for the bar a bearable task. We are very much honored to have you grace this event, our Honorable Chief Justice Gizmundo. Thank you very much for that wonderful message. Now, to formally introduce our authors of the Pre-Week Reviewer for Jittery Bar Takers Volume 1, may we invite the Chief Marketing Officer of Rex Education, Ms. Jean-Marie Fontelera Tordesillas. Ma'am? Thank you very much. Good morning, everyone. Thank you to our CEO and to our chairman and president for opening today's session and our Honorable Chief Justice Gismundo for his message of support. On behalf of Rex Education, it is with great pride and honor that I am sharing this moment with all of you as we get to know the esteemed authors whose brilliance and expertise brought to life the pre-week reviewer for Jittery Bar Takers, Volume 1 political law, and labor law. First on our list is a lecturer and member of the University of Santo Tomas Faculty of Arts and Letters and Faculty of Civil Law. He is also an assistant professorial lecturer at the De La Salle University College of Law and a newly appointed regional trial judge at large. Friends, let us all welcome the Honorable Judge Rigor R. Pascual. Good morning. Good morning, Judge Pascual. Thank you. Next is another esteemed educator a professional lecturer at Adamson University College of Law, Far Eastern University Institute of Law, Lyceum of the Philippines University College of Law, Manila Law College, University of the East College of Law, and University of the Philippines College of Law. 
She is the managing partner at Abad, Abad and Associates, Associates Law Office and is also a bar reviewer at some of the renowned review centers in the country. Not to mention, she is also the current executive vice president of the Philippine Association of Law Schools and a legal counsel at the Philippine Association of Colleges and Universities. Let us all put our hands together for the Dean of the Adamson University College of Law, Dean Anna Maria D. Abad. Good morning, Dean. Magandang umaga sa inyong lahat. Magandang umaga, Jan. Um, I'd rather be called Ada. Thank you very much for this opportunity. Good morning to all. Thank you, Dean. Okay, and finally, completing our roster of authors for Volume 1 is a professorial lecturer at the De La Salle College of Law, Far Eastern University Institute of Law, Lyceum of the Philippines College of Law, Manila Law College, University of the Philippines College of Law and University of the Philippines Faculty of Civil Law. She is also a former Associate Dean of the University of the East College of Law and former Senior Associate at ACRA Law Offices. Aside from all that, she is also a licensed environmental planner and a professor of legal writing at the Department of the Philippine Judicial Academy. Ladies and gentlemen, Professor Victoria V. Luanzon. A pleasant morning, good morning. Professor yeah. Luanzon. <laughs> a pleasant good morning to everyone. Sabi ko nga, uh, it took courage to teach for almost 25 years, but it took more courage to write this book. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, thank you, ma'am. Congratulations, Judge Rigor Pascual, Dean Ada Abad, and Professor Vicky Luanzon, our authors for the first volume of this series. Now, Mom Jen, thank you for that introduction. At this point, to officially introduce our authors for the pre-week reviewer for Jittery Bar Takers Volume 2, may we invite the Chief External Affairs Officer of Rex Education, Ms. Danda Crimelda Buhay. Good morning to one and all. And thank you to Ms. John Marie Tordesillas for the kind introduction of our legal luminaries and partners who came together to make volume one of this book series possible. As we move forward with today's event, I am excited and honored to introduce to you the notable educators and authors who work together to complete the pre-week reviewer for Jittery Bar Takers Volume 2, Civil Law and Taxation Law. First up, as a professional lecturer at the University of the Philippines, De La Salle University, Lyceum of the Philippines University, and University of Santo Tomas. She's also a former partner of ACRA Law and a member of the Order of the Purple Feather the Official Honor Society of the Juris Doctor Program of the University of the Philippines College of Law. Let us put our hands together for Professor Maria Carolina Katrina Legarda. Good morning, Attorney Cap. Good morning. Thanks, Danda. Thank you very much, Rex Bookstore. And of course, I have to thank my co-authors who went along on this journey with me after much plead, not too much pleading. Thank you, and thank you to all who are attending this event with us. Thank you for the trust. Up next, he is a member of the Corps of Professors of the Philippine Judicial Academy and professional lecturer at De La Salle University, Lyceum of the Philippines, University, and University of Santo Tomas. Apart from graduating with a Bachelor of Laws from Ateneo de Manila, University as Salutatorian, he also studied in Intentional Banking Law from Boston University. Friends and colleagues, Professor Avelino M. Sebastian Jr. Good morning, sir. Attorney. Mute. 
Good morning. Mm-hmm. Thank you for joining us today. Uh, I just want to add that this series is a product of thousands of hours of work. And personally for me, several sleepless nights to go through the manuscript. And I hope this book will help pre-bar reviewers. Thank you. I'm sure it will, Professor. Next is another Rex Education author who recently launched his book entitled Multidisciplinary Approach to Legal Writing. He's an associate professor and director of, um, um, of academic support at the De La Salle University College of Law and a former commissioner of the Legal Education Board. He completed his master's of laws from the University of Michigan Law School and let us all give a warm welcome to the director and chief innovator of the Center for Legal Education Advancement and Reform, Attorney Justin D.J. Sumka. Hi, everyone. Good, Good morning. morning. Thank you. Uh, thank you, Rex. Thank you for the trust. Thank you to my uh, co-authors. Thank you po sa pagtitiwala. I really stand on the shoulders of these giants. Thank you, everyone. Okay. And finally, our last author for this volume is an associate professional lecturer from the De La Salle University College of Law, who is also the senior tax manager at Navarro Amper and Company. Friends, let us all welcome her with a round of applause, Professor Shirley C. Poisson. Hi, good morning, everyone. Good morning. Um, it's an honor to be here. Thank you to my co-authors and to Rex. Um, thank you for supporting us. Maraming salamat din po, ma'am. Okay, now congratulations, Professor Katrina Legarda, Professor June Sebastian, Professor Justin Sopgang, and Professor Shirley Tuazon, our authors for the second volume of this series. Also, thank you, Ms. Danda, for that introduction. Now, may we invite again the Chief Marketing Officer of Rex Education, Ms. John Marie Fontalera Tordesillas to officially introduce our authors of the pre-week reviewer for Jittery Bar Takers, Volume 3. Okay, good morning again. And um, now we have the honor to meet uh, the authors of Volume 3. Okay, let us now welcome the great minds who made the pre-week reviewer for Jittery Bar Takers, Volume 3, Commercial Law and Criminal Law one of the most exciting and demanding fields of law practice. Leading the creation of Volume 3 are two of the most proficient and capable practitioners and academicians in the fields of commercial law and criminal law. Our first author is a professorial lecturer at the Far Eastern University, De La Salle University, and University of the East. He was a recipient of the Golden Tamarau Award from FEULAA. On top of that, he is also a bar reviewer and a mandatory continuing legal education lecturer at the top bar review and MCLE centers in the country. Let us give a virtual round of applause to the Dean of Manila Law College, Dean Serio M. Seniza. Good morning, Dean. Thank you, John. Uh, it's my pleasure to be part of this group. I'm pleased to be uh, a part of this initiative for our students and the bar takers. Thank you and good day. Thank you so much, Dean. All right. Our second author is also a professor of law at the Far Eastern University, Pamantasa ng Lungsod ng Maynila, Lyceum of the Philippines University, and De La Salle University. Also, he is a pre-bar reviewer for criminal law and a mandatory continuing legal education lecturer at the top bar review and MCLE centers in the country. He is a partner at Gilera and Tikman Law Firm and a member of the panel of experts consulted by the Supreme Court for the post-validation of the multiple choice questions in criminal law for the 2011 bar examinations. Let us welcome with a warm virtual applause, Professor Modesto A. Tikman Jr. 
Good morning, Professor Tikman. Good morning at magandang araw sa inyong lahat. Uh, Unang-una, nagpapasalamat ako doon sa mga kasamahan ko na uh, nagsagawa nitong proyekto na ito. At pangalawa, lalong-lalo na doon sa mga estudyante ng batas na tumangkilik dito sa libro kito. Kung sa totoo lang, lumabas ito as early as March pa yata. At uh, ang feedback sa amin, eh, medyo maganda naman. Sana uh, ituloy nyo yung uh, pagtangkilik nitong mga libro na sinagawa namin ngayon. Maraming salamat, Rex. Thank you, Professor Tikman. All right, congratulations, Dean Serge Seniza and Professor Jojo Tikman, our authors for the third volume of this series. Also, Thank you, Ms. John, for the introduction. Now, may we invite again the Chief External Affairs Officer of Rex Education, Ms. Danda, to officially introduce our authors of the pre-week reviewer for Jittery Bar Takers, Volume 4. Okay, thank you so much. Rounding up our four-volume series are three more notable professors and law practitioners who have been a partner of Rex Education for its legal publications. These three distinguished ladies are the core and heart of the fourth installation in our series, the pre-week reviewer for Jittery Bar Takers, Volume 4, Remedial Law and Legal and Judicial Ethics. Leading this powerful all-women group is an examiner for remedial law in the 2019 bar examinations and the chairperson for the Civil Law Department of the Philippine Judicial Academy. She's also a professorial lecturer of law at Ateneo de Malila University, University of the Philippines, University of Santo Tomas, and Lyceum of the Philippines. Sharing her year-long expertise in remedial law, ladies and gentlemen, the Associate Justice of the Court of Appeals, the Honorable Justice Maria Filomena D. Singh. Good morning, Good morning Justice. Good morning, Danda. Thank you. And good morning, everyone. Uh, on behalf of my uh, co-authors, we would like to say thank you to Rex Education and to the Buhain family. And we would also like to say thank you to all of you who gave your time to join us today in this virtual book launch, especially the Chief Justice. Maraming salamat. Thank you, Pop. Welcome. Joining Justice Singh is the chairperson of the Philippine Association of Law Schools and professorial lecturer too of the Philippine Judicial Academy. She is the founder, Maui's Law Office, and a member of the Civil Law Department of the Philippine Judicial Academy. Also, she's a professorial lecturer at the Colleges of Law of the Lyceum of the Philippines University, University of the Philippines, De La Salle University, University of Santo Tomas, and Adamson University. She's also a resource person for the mandatory continuing legal education and a bar reviewer in persons and family relations, civil procedure, and evidence at the top bar review centers in the country. Let us, let us put our hands together for the Dean of Lyceum of the Philippines College of Law, Dean Maria Soledad de Requito Mawis. Good morning. Good morning. Thank you very much for your gracious uh, introduction. Rami pung salamat sa inyong pagtangkilik. Um, our books are our way of giving back to the profession that gave so much to us. We hope you will have an easy reading. Thank you and see you around. Thank you. Thank you. And last but not the least, we have already introduced her from volume one. But her wide range of expertise has her coming back for Volume 4 on remedial law and legal and judicial ethics. With no need for further introduction, let us welcome back Professor Victoria V. Luanzon. Good morning, Professor. Good morning, Danda. Let me just make a public disclosure. Every time I will see uh, Attorney Buhain in my MCLE lectures, he will always ask me, Vicky, when are you going to write a book on legal ethics? 
Kasi yan lagi ang field na where I uh, touch on no? sa MCL lectures. Sabi ko sa kanya, Sir, ayaw kong sumulat ng legal ethics book. Namamatay po kasi yung mga authors niyan eh. Namatay mm-hmm. po si Agpalo, si Pineda, <laughs> si Sabio. Kaya sabi ko, Sir, pag-iisipan ko pong mabuti. So, I think after writing this book, I am ready to die. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> no, not yet. <laughs> Thank you po. 50 Thank more you. years, Professor. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you very much. Okay. Thank you very much, uh, Ms. Danda, for that introduction. And congratulations to Justice Monet Singh. Uh, Dean Sol de Riquito Mawis and Professor Vicky Luanzon, our authors for the last volume of the series. Okay, now it is time to hear the message from the authors of the pre-week reviewer for Jittery Bar Takers, Volumes 1 to 4, to be represented by the Honorable Justice Maria Filomena D. Singh. Everyone, a warm virtual applause for our Justice Monette Singh. Thank you very much, um, the Honorable Chief Justice Alexander Hesmundo. To my esteemed co-authors of the Jittery Bar Review Takers Compendium, to Dean uh, Hill de los Reyes of De La Salle University College of Law, Dean Ferdi Negre of the MLQU College of Law, colleagues, friends, ladies and gentlemen, and to our publisher, Rex Education, and its president, Attorney Buhain, and Mr. Don Buhain. On behalf of my co-authors, I was tasked to deliver this response. Just to be clear, I was chosen for this task solely because I was absent from the meeting when the book launch was planned. I am blaming Dean Sol Mawis for this because I gave her my SPA to represent me at that meeting and I ended up doing this task this morning. I claim no primacy over my co-authors, for how could I? They are all renowned experts in their respective subjects, and not one is unschooled in our legal system. We have no less than three deans among us. We have Dean Sol of, of Lyceum, we have Dean Ada Abad of Adamson, and we have Dean Serge Seniza of Manila Law College. We also have Vice Dean Vicky Luanzon of UE Law. And for tax, we have Attorney Shirley Tuazon from Deloitte, the leading tax and audit firm, not only in the Philippines, no, but everywhere else in the world. Then, who does not know Professor Jojo Tikman, the criminal law expert? He's well-loved by his students and by buyers of his previous books because of his succinct explanations of even the most complex criminal law concepts. According to Dean Solmawis, Professor Jojo is a criminal lawyer without a criminal mind. And, of course, who does not know the grand dame? of persons and family relations, Dame Katrina Legarda, and of course, Kat, Kat's partner, no, not in crime, no? uh, my former professor, my personal guru and Yoda in civil law, Professor Avelino June Sebastian. No? Last but certainly not the least, we have two of the up-and-coming stars no, in the legal firmament, one is already an RTC judge. You met him earlier, Judge Rigor Pascual, who is a very close aide of the Chief Justice. And the second, Professor Justin Sokgang, who could easily pass as a member of BTS, <laughs> but is already firmly entrenched in academia with his Masters of Law and Scholarly Works. No? Together, my co-authors have combined legal history and experience spanning four decades, no? and they are all published authors many times over. So now you understand why I was chosen to deliver the response, because I am the amateur. No? I I am the newbie in the group. I fell in love with books at a very young age. And I am not speaking of the usual fairy tales and nursery rhymes. No, As I grew up, I firmly endeavored to embark on a fiction writing career. Okay, But you know what they say, you know, faith and faith intervened. And here I am before you. Of course, every lawyer dreams of publishing a law book. 
But I never thought I could actually do it because of the amount of work and time it requires. Fortunately, we had a very formidable taskmaster. No, I don't want to call to call her slave driver, <laughs> Professor Legarda, who was very strict about deadlines and who could not be swayed, no, even after several bottles of red wine. No? Uh, but by the way, the title Jittery Bar Takers was all Cat Legarda, okay? But I would never have done it without her prodding and the generous guidance of my partner in remedial law, Dean Sol Mawis. And of course, Professor June Sebastian's ever-ready last-minute saves when it came to formatting and putting my uh, presentations in the proper tables. No? So now I can cross this one item from my bucket list. list no? And that is spelled bucket, no? bucket list, B-A-K-I-T. And I end by answering that that question, bakit, no? Because at heart, like my co-authors, I am a teacher. And for a teacher, the greatest joy is to see your students learn. These books we authored is our individual and collective way of spreading our teachings and our guidance, our dedication, and our devotion, not only to our students and our respective law institutions, but to the entire legal profession and to our motherland. Thank you and good day to everyone. All right, thank you very much, Justice Singh, for <clears throat> delivering such an impactful message from the authors of these books. May this message inspire more law students to do well in the bar exam. The roster of experts and luminaries who author these books are truly exemplary. We hope that you'd be able to secure all the copies. That's volumes one to four of the pre-week reviewer for Jittery Bar Taker. So take note to all our viewers. Uh, as early as now, secure your uh, copy of the pre-week reviewer for the jittery bar takers. Now, optimize your learning potential, review all the key topics few days before the exam, and sit for the bar exam with confidence by equipping yourself with the pre-week reviewer for jittery bar takers. Volumes one to four of these books are available nationwide on Rex Bookstore branches. So, what are you waiting for? Grab your copies of the full series and visit the nearest Rex book branches in your area. You may also purchase the full series online through Rex eStore. Now you can see the links in the caption below. All right. So as promised, this time, five lucky winners will be receiving the complete volume of the pre-week reviewer for Jittery Bar Takers. Now, if you register to the link pinned in the comments below, then you have a chance to be one of the five lucky recipients of these books. All right, so again, just a reminder, we will be announcing the name of the lucky person for this raffle. If your name is called, please comment down present. All right, <clears throat> so we know that you're here with us. Okay, so we are going to spin the wheel. And our first winner is Jonaline Amistas Brillantes. Okay, Jonaline Amistas Brillantes, kindly comment present in the chat box if you are here okay because we have to verify if it's you, if it's you who won okay so you are given 30 seconds to do so now if you fail to comment within 30 seconds this is for all okay uh if we do not see your name we will be drawing another winner from our list of registrants so good luck all right let me just verify okay so she is present. All right. Congratulations. Jonaline Amistas Brillantes. Okay, so I think we are ready to spin the wheel again, this time for our second winner. All right, so spin the wheel now. 
this is exciting okay so please make sure that you're glued to your uh, gadget screen all right okay we have michelle ann magnaye michelle ann magnaye are you here if you're here please comment present in our chat box so we can verify all right because if not we will be drawing another winner Okay, you have 30 seconds. Okay, so I hope you don't miss this uh, opportunity. Okay, because uh, we are giving away five copies, no? complete volume of the pre-week reviewer for Jittery Bar Takers. Okay, so we have verified that Michelle Ann Magnaye is present. Congratulations. Now, are we ready? to know who our third winner is? If so, please spin the wheel. Okay, so we have Michael Vincent and Daya Bautista. Michael Vincent and Daya Bautista. If you're here, kindly comment your name. I'm sorry, comment present, okay, in the chat box. If you are here, you'll be given 30 seconds to do so. Okay, our team from Rex Education will be verifying if you are present. All right. So this is for our third winner. Are you here? Let's see. All right, congratulations. Michael Vincent Bautista. You just won a complete set, you know, a complete volume of this book. So are we ready for the fourth one? Okay, kindly spin the wheel now. Okay, this is getting more and more exciting. Let's see. We have Nikki de Guzman. Nikki, please comment present in the chat box. So our uh, partners from Rex Education would be able to verify if you are still here with us. Okay, you have 30 seconds to do so. Is Nikki still present? Okay, 10 seconds, Nikki. Seven, six, five. Four, three, two, one. All right. So no response from Nikki. Oh, okay. Sorry. There. There you are. So Nikki de Guzman is present. Congratulations, Nikki. You are the fourth winner of the book, the, the full volume of the book. Okay. So we're down to our last uh, raffle winner. So kindly spin the wheel. Okay, our final winner is Lirad Q. Okay, that's odd, Lirad Q. What is your full name? Is that Lirad? Okay, Lirad Q, if you're present, please comment present in our chat box. Okay, 30 seconds starts now. Okay, Lirard Q, are you here? Okay, so you are present, but with a different name. That's okay. Kindly comment your name in our uh, chat box. Okay, so the name is Daryl Markson Quinto. Okay, so that's Daryl Mark Quinto. So that explains the letter Q. Are you here? Yes. Daryl is here. Okay, so Daryl Markson Quinto, you are the fifth winner of the book. Okay, actually the complete set of books. Okay, the pre-week reviewer for Jittery Bar Takers. All right, so congratulations to the five lucky winners of our raffle. 
Again, congratulations and thank you very much to our authors. Now on that note, we have come to the end of this morning's program. Indeed, it was a very productive morning with our legal luminaries, our distinguished guests from the field of law. In behalf of Rex Education, I would like to express our heartfelt gratitude for having been chosen as your partner in legal education. We look forward to more years of fruitful partnership as we continue to work together to enable law students, bar reviewees, and lawyers to achieve their dreams of becoming lawyers and excelling as one. To everyone who joined us this morning, thank you very much for learning with us and for choosing Rex to be your partner in learning. See you all on our next book launch. Thank you and keep soaring, Edo Campeones. <laughs>